Okay, so right now we are in Buffalo Thunder Resort Casino, fixing to go to Santa Fe Comic Con. And today we're going to be doing a little bit of toy hunting, movie hunting, and talk to some celebrities. So stay tuned. More booths than you can shake a stick at here in Santa Fe. Check out this right here. We got some autographs from the original Star Wars cast. And Princess Leia here. And here are some of the guests. Gold dust. Remember gold dust? Oh, that's cool. Look at this autograph of uh, Freddy Krueger right here. We have some autograph pops. That's a very cool Venom pop. Rick Grimes. Look at that. Alfred Hitchcock. The Wizard of Oz, Frankenstein even, Michael Jackson back there, and then we also have Iron Fist right there. Twilight Zone. Look at this one, the Golden Girls. Going for a thousand. Christopher Reeves back there. Oh, look at that, Jim Henson right there. We have some more Walking Dead and a ton of pins. seen anything like this. Eric Estrada. Lily Monster. You see one you want? You see one? My boss makes them with her hands. She makes these herself? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, they put together the images. So we just bought a candle from Saints for Sinner Candles. Here. And we got... Eric Estrada. <laughs> Blows my mind. Okay.
Hey, good, you. Check out this old Fantastic Four comic book. 320 is the asking price. And that's about that one built there for 280. Holy cow. So here we have Billy Cranston from the Power Rangers. Eric Estrada. Yeah, I think you're right. And then here you can actually pick up hold this for one second. This is actually a pretty hard movie to come across. These made for TV Captain America movies. Also have the Simpsons shorts. The Fantastic Four movie that never got put to air. of other good stuff. This was always one of my favorites growing up, the Green Hornet. 45. 45 is the asking price. And then of course you got Robocop. And the made for TV, Spider-Man. Cartoons, The Addams Family, Felix the Cat, Doug. That one's 45 as well. Check that out. This guy looks awfully familiar. That's cool. He's the star of that is becoming a TV show. Oh, is it? The book is right over there, and it crashes the government has suppressed for years. Okay. That's cool. Um, we saw one just like that in Roswell, too. Yeah? Uh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Right. I'm just joking. 
Argentina politics. Well, over ten years goes this one. Okay. That's my first mother-in-law. Oh. Um, there are things in there that will blow your mind. How much were you wanting for it? Seventeen ninety-five. Seventeen ninety-five. You get two. I give you a ten percent discount. Okay. we have the amazing spider-man oh check that one out candy man right here 250 oh yeah that's really cool that's actually a comic-con exclusive isn't that cool Hey, good, you? I'm good, thank you. Yeah? Yeah. And these are all? There's a lady on the other side who's got a bunch of different candles and stuff. Really? Like, yeah, custom made. Oh, wow, that's crazy. That's funny though, I like that. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. And then of course we have Chewbacca one. here. Right. We'll go find out. Check this out. Look at that spider girl here. That bitch. Just a rabbit. That's neat. We have that one actually. More pops than you can shake a stick at. Look at that cereal. Or what is that? Oh, that's a t-shirt. Huh? <laughs> That Conan O'Brien. Good old Yoki. Can't go wrong there. show we were watching the other day? Yeah. So much pops. I know. 
Oh, look at this. Power line. That's really cool. I thought it was your guy, but... Yeah, that's pretty cool. Give me your money back. There's a troll. That guy right there. This is a chase, a glow chase. We have that chase. one. Oh, we have yeah, I remember I got it for you for your birthday last year. For the Scooby Doo collection. More movies than you can shake a stick at. <laughs> <laughs> and look at all these toys. So it's 40, 50. Homer back there. That is pretty well detailed. And of course, that's right. That's right. Look at this Riker figure. And is that the Burger King guy? More G.I. Joes. And of course, Batman. Yeah, I saw that. Superman here. Look at this Robin. Quasimodo. That's a really cool tin man. So right here is the line for Elvira. Getting closer. You might go ahead and do it. My friend has a booth over there. Sure, sure. Do you want to do anyone or just uh, Elvira? Just Elvira is fine. Why? Oh, no worries. <laughs> How are you? 
Turkish. She was hoping to get an autograph from you. Well, I'm really tripping. It's the altitude, man. Yeah. And space. And space. Is this your first time in New Mexico? Yeah. Well, here. Yeah? Yeah. Look. I want a picture with you. I want to get a picture with Chewbacca. And I have to ask, did you keep in touch with Pat Boone over there? Oh, years? yeah. Yeah. Pat and Sherry, yeah. Mm -hmm. I I'll run into him once in a while. Do ya? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I love that movie crossing. Did you know I did that movie 50 years ago? Yeah. Wow. 50 years ago. I'm 69 now. But I did it when I was 19. I just turned actor at 18. And, and I auditioned for that movie by improvisation. <laughs> and I knew they were bringing in Pat for the sixth callback. They were bringing in Pat to match him up with me and another guy. And I went to 42nd Street in New York City and bought a switchblade. And, and I went to the audition, nobody knew I had a real knife in my back pocket. Yeah. And in the scene with Pat, I pulled it out, scared the crap out of him. But I got the part. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> nice. Yeah, we're still waiting for that movie to get a Blu ray release. Blu ray? Yeah. It's not a Blu ray yet? I don't think it is. We've only come across the DVD at the Christian store. Yeah. It's a great movie, though. <laughs> That's, that's a beauty oh, right there. You. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Nice to meet you. God bless. Thank you for talking to us. Different cereals here. Fantastic four box. Super cool. What is your name in question? Uh, my name is Navar, and how come that intern would for her to into a movie? We're working on that. The conversation has started because we uh, guest starred on the Jimmy Fallon show. And when we were on the Jimmy Fallon show, the fans went bananas. And so that turned on the light at Nickelodeon. They were like, well, wait a minute. <laughs> we need to do Good Burger too. So Keenan and I actually met up, and we met up with the producers and the writers, and it's about getting the story the right way, you know what I mean? Because we don't want to do a part two when it's not as good as one. <laughs> so uh, we're trying to get the script right, and then also Nickelodeon owns the licensing to that. But so we're, you know, it's a whole business side of it too. They get it all together. Yeah. <laughs> There's a book for part two. It is. It's called Good Burger to Go. Good Burger to Go. But I don't know if they want to do that one as a as a film though. <laughs> yeah. But it's a good book. Did you read it? You liked it? Yeah, man. Good burger to go. You saw how I did that? Uh, let me see, man. I play Christian hip hop. I also play hip hop. Uh, Chance the Rapper is up there, too. You know what I mean? Like Chance. Uh, who else is up there? Drake. I just went to Drake's concert. That was crazy. Kendrick Lamar, of course, is off the chain. Gotta love Kendrick. Uh, who else, man? Rakim. We go back, go in the crates. He don't know who Rakim is. You know who Rakim is? Introduce him to Rock Hill. That's that, that's that hip hop, you know what I'm saying? 
man. A whole bunch of rappers, man. J. Cole. Uh, I love hip hop, man. I love like, no, a lot Dave of Matthews fans or Oh, well, I thought we were talking hip hop. No. Oh, it's why, everything. Why does it have to be hip hop? Okay, it don't have to be hip hop. Hey, it's, it's Stevie Wonder. Yeah. Love me some Stevie. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Aretha Franklin, you know? Yeah, yeah no. Oh. <laughs> Keisha Cole, uh, Tank. You don't even know who that is. Look at you, see. You know Tank. <laughs> hey, you know Tank? He don't know Tank. He said, well, who Tank is? Who Tank is? <laughs> you would not do that. <laughs> he said, you do not know. <laughs> They're making fun of me because my idea of a rapper is DJ Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince. Okay, and Fresh Prince was the rapper. <laughs> Did you? <laughs> I mean, they had the music. Uh, great uh, opportunities that I had, you know what I mean? That in great roles, you know what I mean? And I still feel like I still want that that big role, you know what I mean? Like it's, that I'm looking for. I always set goals for myself, so uh, even higher. Like I never want to go like, oh, this was the diet and learning. You know what I mean? You have to do that because you get actors that are just like, well, I did this, and, <laughs> you know, 75, so I'm this person. And it's just like, dude, like, come on, man. You gotta, like, really embrace it and just keep just building and doing uh, more exciting things and enjoy what you do and don't, you know, and know that it takes a whole, like, uh, crew to make it happen. You know what I mean? It takes a whole crew to make it happen, and it's, we're all working together, you know what I mean? So I, I never, you know, feel like I, I'm, I hate that, though. Time, time. I got so many surprises coming up. <laughs> yeah. So much more. Okay, yeah. so um, we're gonna do, I'll take his question and then one more question. Yeah. So, um, what is your name and question? Uh, hi, my name's Ben, and are we ever gonna see a sequel to Mystery Men? Hey, yeah, a lot of people have been talking about that too. I think we need to do that. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think so, man. I saw uh, Paul Rubens recently at uh, Kamikaze, Stan Lee's uh, Comic-Con, and <laughs> so we were hanging out. And uh, a lot of people like Mystery Man. They're doing a lot of cosplay with Mystery Man now. I've seen a lot of Invisible Boys and, and it's Furious and stuff like nice. that. So that would be dope. I'd be Invisible Man at this point. <laughs> yeah, right. Got a little, <laughs> a little older, but yeah, that would be fun. Yeah. That was a fun, that, that would be fun. That was a fun set, too. <laughs> yeah. Perfect. Okay, there was an individual somewhere here. I saw a hand, and I don't remember now. I got distracted. You do? Okay. Oof. I was a little shaken up talking to him that time. You sounded good. You sounded fine. <laughs> Look at this group figure. Jason back there. Good burger? Sandra Peterson's table is still going crazy. We have Al Snow here. Well, that's gonna do it for this Comic Con video. We had a lot of fun today. We uh, met a lot of interesting people and we have a pretty good haul. So stay tuned for that portion. Other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you give it a thumbs up. Let's me know that you care. Alright, talk to you soon.